Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Art Aberration. Gonna be working on taming one of the giant apes today. I went down to get some water, and right over that way, there's one of the ones that spawned in, in that little spawn area for the aberrant ones. So we need to grab some berries. I don't have any of the vegetables or anything, because I haven't done any farming yet. But we'll grab some berries, some of the purple ones, and go down and tame them. He is a passive tame. And since he is down there, we'll be wearing our full hazmat suit. And I think we need to take the bear out because all we're going to have on him... Or not even on him. I think all we got is just some of the red berries. Yeah, the roll rat doesn't even have anything. Check over here and then check in our fridge. Oh wait, we got some. We shouldn't need too many because... I don't have my settings set to where it's going to take a long time. Yeah, that's it though. That should be enough. Shouldn't be a problem. Let's grab the other stack, just in case. Put those down in our taming slot. And put our helmet on, just in case. Oh wait, why am I getting on him? We're gonna go down on foot, I think. Yeah, we'll leave everything up here. I think my Ravager's still bugged, man. Yeah, we're gonna have to put him down, I think. I don't know what his deal is, man. He's still got that... That bug where it says that he's knocked out, but he's not. Oh yeah, let's turn my light on so we don't get any nameless. That would be horrible right now because all I have on me is just a pike. And he was right over here. Wait, I think he's down this way. He was. I think we're going to have to find him. Come on, dude, where'd you go to, man? Ah, oh, there he is there. Dude, he wanders far. He was, like, down there last time I saw him. If that's him, it was a 130 or 140. Yee, 135. Wild male, aberrant, eight. So, I don't think bug spray works, and we don't have any ghillie. So we're gonna have to do the sneaky sneaky. Hopefully don't get him to turn around and punch us because, dude, if he punches us, uh, we're in a bad... <laughs> we're gonna be in for a bad day. Dude, quit walking, man. Oh, there we go. We got one. And that was how much? Dude, that did not give as much at all. 16%? Kind of worried. I probably should have checked the area up here. I didn't. Down there was cleared out. Oh, he's not ready yet. Yeah, Gilly would have helped. Oh, man, there's a centipede up there. I don't know if something else aggroes him. If it'll mess up the team. I know if I aggro him, it will. Do it like this. That way I can see a little bit better. <gasps> easy, man. Easy. He walked so fast. But I think we can use him... Yes, I'm not hungry. We can use him to cl climb along some of the zip lines. And then we can ride on his shoulders. And he's supposed to be a pretty good mount. I don't think I remember ever taming one. So it's definitely going to be interesting to play with. And oh, man. Well. Oh, wait. Yeah, come for me, man. Don't go for him. Here. Ah, I got him. Well. Hopefully that doesn't mess it up. Because that's going to suck. I had him, man. I didn't need your help. Let's see what his taming bar is at. Oh, wait. We can feed him again. Oh, get closer. Oh, it resets it. Dude. Well, the... Effectiveness is still good. It just resets the tame. There's a centipede up there. We need him to keep walking down this way. You know, I might throw out my... Megalosaurus to clean out the centipedes and stuff. Because, dude, that has to keep resetting him every time. Where'd he go? Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> you all right in there, man? Don't be fighting nothing. Oh, he's stuck. <gasps> oh, I'm sorry, man. I'll back up. Oh, give him some space. I don't know if it's good that he's stuck in here or bad. Hey, don't be eating nothing, man. I got food for you. Dude, it takes forever, man. Oh. Oh, don't hit him. I was going to get the snake out of the way. Yeah, it's your kill, man. <laughs> you take all you want. Just don't get mad at me. I need to get some of this brush out of the way. If I can get him far enough away, I'll chop some of these trees so we can actually see. Can I pick that? I can. There we go. Open it up some. Let's get, um, we'll do it as Statch. That way I don't get weighed down. <gasps> what is that? It's another centipede! Dude, it's gonna reset him again. Come on, man. Well, let's go ahead and get this guy out. Might as well help him out. There we go. Is there anything else around? Man, I should have done this in the start. Let's go ahead and take all these out. Dung beetle should be fine. And we'll leave, we'll leave the Megalosaurus out here. On passive. You hear me? Passive. Don't go messing with the ape. Oh crap. <laughs> the ape's coming for him. Alright, you just stay there, man. I'm serious. No monkeying around with this. All right, let's try to get some more berries in them. All right, so there's one for the third time. Let's go ahead and jump on our Megalosaurus. Just to keep everything cleared out around here. While we wait for the next feeding. You know, I thought I told him not to go messing with nothing. And he's down there trying to tear stuff up. This dude still does not even want another bear yet. Uh, I'm gonna go see what he's getting into, man. Starting trouble. He was way up here when I left him. So you're sitting there letting that snake tear you up? Is that what it is? Where'd the ape go to now? There he is. Kind of not sure where to leave the Megalosaurus at since uh, everything around wants to attack him and the ape kind of keeps following him. I right, see if we can get a second berry into him. Still not hungry. Boy, I tell you what. Oh, let's get our Megalosaurus. Nice, there we go. Second berry. Took forever. I think I might have to cryopod this Megalosaurus. Only thing is, man, if a uh, centipede or something spawns, it's gonna reset that guy again. He's already been reset twice because of creatures around. I hope the dung beetle doesn't aggro him. Let's go ahead and just get it out of here. And there's a whole pack of Ravagers over there. Oh, he's ready again. Slow down, man. He's still got 99.2% effectiveness, so... 
It doesn't seem like a messed up any. And we are at, what, 50%? Somewhere around there? It should go faster now. Usually it's after that first one or two that it picks up the speed on the feeding interval. There's another Megalosaurus over there. He was uh, attacking one of the moles. He's like right over next to mine, so that's kind of got me worried because mine's on passive. So far, it's been going pretty good, though. If we can just keep from getting aggro from this guy, because he'll, man, he'll punt us halfway across the map. Oh, nice. There we go. So probably, what, two more? Possibly three? Let's get our Megalosaurus over here, because... I don't know if there's anything down there. He's kind of going... Hey, you take you off a of follow. I don't know. Why you holler, man? I don't know if anything else is spawning down here. Check the area real quick. I think we're still good. <laughs> Dude's making all that noise, man. Freaking me out. Are right, you ready for another berry, man? Almost. Not yet. His effectiveness is going down now. It's starting to drop. Which, I mean, it doesn't matter. We'll still get plenty of levels out of him. Nice. Another berry. So one more should do it. It's an easy team, but it's kind of... It's time time consuming at the same time, you know? So it's easy but hard. Oh, let's get this dude out of the way. And I don't think we need a saddle or nothing. I think he just ride on his back. Let's double check over here for snakes. Yeah, we're good. One more berry, man. Then we can be friends. Is that a snake? That's a bear. That's some... Just flowers. <laughs> Just flowers. Oh, man. It's a horrible time for an earthquake. Let's double check one last time real quick. If it throws us into him. Oh, dude. It'd be, <laughs> it'd be game over. Let me get on my mount. We'll keep him safe. Make sure nothing gets to him until this earthquake's done with. Dude, I tell you what, these earthquakes are like horrible timing every single time. All right, the earthquake is finally over. Let's get up here, get this last berry in him, not mess it up, and that should be it. Oh, he's getting really close. Really close to my Megalosaurus. Nice! Dude, you talk about being close, man. Holy crap. Hey, don't go nowhere, man. Where are you going? Let's get you in the cryopod. And we'll take the ape for a spin. See what he does, man. I'm kind of curious. Wait, what have you got? Bunch of stuff I don't need. I'm going to take the venom. Alright, cool. So it aimed out to be a level 201. 2300 on the health. Stamina is 930, weight is 356, uh, damage is 330%, and movement speed is 106%. <laughs> that looks funny, man. I'm uh, kind of big to be riding on him. We well, got me and then the little billy goat as well. Oh, he moves pretty fast, so. He does jump. I'm not sure what that does. And then there should be a way to throw me, right? Oh, there is. Oh, I can aim. Let's go. Oh, you can't aim that well. Let's go this way. I wonder if I can throw myself and then use the zip line or the glider. <laughs> it's awesome, man. You can. I just need to make sure to take him off a of follow. That'd be a good way to launch off of the platform up there. So what do we need to put stats into? Well, definitely health, which goes up a lot. And we need to find something to beat on. I don't want to go that way because there's a bunch of Ravagers. Let's go... 
Let's see what's over this way. And on the way, we'll see if we can climb up a zip line. Figure out how it works with them. I can't remember if you climbs underneath it or walks on top. Oh, there's a snake. Perfect timing. So 140. Put that in damage. It goes up 13%. And we'll see what he uh what he does. Does he pick berries, I wonder? Possibly? <gasps> I forgot that throws me. That's gonna get me killed, man. I see that already. Oh, he does. So he is a harvester. And we are severely overweight now. Wait, why do I have all this stuff in me? I don't remember getting anything. Oh, I was picking those berries, that's right. Which, I mean, speaking of that, we'll leave the purple ones in him. And then I want to hit something before we put any more points in to see how much that goes up. Oh, there's a drop. We'll head that way. See what we can't find along the way. I think if we find any Megalosaurus, I need to not attack him because I bet I could probably get ripped off of him. And there's another snake. Perfect. Come here, buddy. Let me smack at you a little bit. So 145. So it goes up 5% on each one. So we will definitely be putting some points into damage to protect us. And I'm guessing I should probably put some into weight. Can I access this? Without getting off? I can't. He's got another level up. Put that into health. Improvised explosive device. I didn't know that was a thing. Huh. Interesting. Don't want it, though. <laughs> Thanks for the offer. Alright. Before we go, let's head up and see about the zip line with him. See what we can get done with climbing that. Might be able to take him around instead of the Ravager when we're just uh, scouting around. Seems like he can protect himself pretty well. I don't know how we would attach to it. Oh, wait. He has a prompt for it. All right, so he climbs underneath, and that looks extremely awkward. Oh, my gosh. Look at the strength on that guy, man. We're at an angle. He must do a lot of sit-ups. <laughs> I don't know how how I'm going to get up top here, though. I'll have to change my my zip line around. Oh, nice. And then he slides down it. Dude, that's awesome, man. I like how he can throw you. And then you can use uh, the glider suit. It's going to be fun to play with for sure. Well... We got ourselves a monkey, or an ape, sorry. Monkey, it's a totally different thing. I'm gonna go ahead and continue working on the Megalosauruses. I'll probably come back for one more video before we do Rockwell, just to uh, go over the stats and everything and finish hatching some. I'm gonna aim for 10 to 15 of them. So, I'm gonna go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.